Imagine you're just standing outside. It's quiet, a normal morning. Sunlight, wind, coffee, traffic, life. And then everything becomes lighter. You feel your coffee mug slipping upward, almost weightless. Your hair floats for no reason. There's no wind, no sound, just silence. You look around and the impossible is happening. A plastic bag drifts up, then a newspaper, and the person next to you slowly lifts off the ground. Five seconds. That's all it takes to destroy everything. Gravity. Nice. The one force we never think about. It doesn't just keep you on the ground, and it keeps everything together. The oceans, the mountains, the air you breathe, the coffee in your cup. Without gravity, there's no down, no weight. No normal. If gravity vanished, even for a moment, everything that isn't nailed down no longer belongs to Earth. In the first second, people just feel lighter. In the second, things start to float. Coins drift out of pockets, cars rise off the road, airplanes lose control, water from lakes and oceans begins to lift into the sky. Dogs, trees, people, all pulled upward by nothing. And even the air itself starts escaping because gravity is what keeps our atmosphere from leaking into space. Without it, the air just leaves. By the third second, Earth turns into a surreal painting. Billions of tons of water hang above the surface like a shimmering curtain. Voices fade. There's almost no air to carry sound. Planes spin silently upward. Clouds scatter, and the sky goes white. For a moment, it's eerily peaceful. Somewhere in that silence, someone realizes how fragile normal really is. We think we're grounded, stable, safe. But the truth is, we're only held together by one invisible force. And it could vanish in an instant. Fourth second. Everything hovers, frozen in midair. People, houses, oceans, cars, dust, all suspended. It almost looks beautiful, like time itself has stopped. A perfect, weightless world. But that piece is a lie. Fifth second. Gravity returns, instantly and everything that went up comes crashing down. The oceans slam back onto the surface. Air collapses inward. Planes fall, buildings crumble, and people hit the ground. A global wave of destruction, five seconds in the making. In one heartbeat, every kind of disaster happens at once. Tsunamis, earthquakes, hurricanes. The sky darkens as debris falls back to Earth. Then, silence again. The air settles dust hangs in the light. And what's left is a very different planet. Five seconds. That's all it took. You might say, well, that's impossible. Gravity can't just turn off. And you're right. Gravity isn't a switch. It's not even a force in the usual sense. It's the shape of space itself, the way mass bends reality. If gravity disappeared, so would the universe. But that's not the point. Every day, we live as if the ground beneath us is permanent, as if stability is guaranteed. But sometimes, it only takes five seconds to realize how little is actually holding us together. He looks up at the stars and whispers, we never thank gravity, we just take it for granted. Maybe it's worth remembering that everything keeping us grounded, our lives, our balance, our world, could disappear in a heartbeat. The world returns to normal, People drink coffee again, planes fly, the oceans breathe, everything feels the same. But somehow, you don't look at the sky the same way anymore. Five seconds without gravity, five seconds to destroy everything, and a lifetime to understand how much it means to be held down.